Huskers pound the pavement to raise awareness of veteran suicide. The UNL Student Veterans of America chapter joins the annual Ruck March. This year's trek began at Freedom Rock in Menlo, Iowa and ended about 150 miles later in Lincoln's Memorial Stadium. Student veterans, volunteers, and local veterans along the way deliver a game football to the Huskers-Hawkeyes matchup. As they walk, each volunteer carries a backpack filled with 20 pounds or 20 items. It's a somber reminder of a Veterans Administration report that every day 20 American veterans take their own lives. A statewide survey shows a lack of child care options in rural Nebraska. The Nebraska Rural Poll is the largest annual survey of rural Nebraskans' perceptions about policy and quality of life. 61% of respondents said that there is a shortage of affordable child care in their community. 59% agreed that their community needs more before and after school options, and more than 81% feel that child care is important to their community's growth. UNL's Department of Agriculture Economics conducted the poll. 1,100 households in 86 of the state's 93 counties responded to the poll. To see the full report, visit ruralpoll.unl.edu. An Omaha-based band delights audiences across the state. Mariachi Zapata toured Fremont, Grand Island, Nebraska City, and Kearney as part of the Lead Center's Arts Across America education program. Each tour stop includes a public performance, school matinees, and educational outreach. Arts are for everyone, and um, arts education is for everyone, um, regardless of uh, your geography, um, your income, you know, the LEAD Center is um, the home of the performing arts in Nebraska, and for us that means the entire state. So part of our mission is to make sure that we are taking those experiences that we create here at the LEAD Center and sharing them with our whole state. This is the LEAD Center's 26th season of Arts Across Nebraska. That's what's happening this week at UNL. I'm Elena Tomish.